What's good guys, 12th Nation back here today, and as you can see, we're going into our preferences, turning off the analog stick, going back to the touch controls, and that simple change is going to allow you to scramble, which sounds insane, but right out of the gate, you can tell the speed difference right away, and we're just going to call the same play action plays over and over, try to get my scramble on, and this is like my second season game doing this, so... Some of the time I'll pass it accidentally because I'm trying to click the scramble to move, but I'm actually clicking near a receiver, which kind of sucks. Russell Wilson picking up a lot of yards for us, abusing that speed, and what the touch controls allow you to do, so that's an accidental throw right there, but you can see the speed still at the beginning. But touch controls eliminate the time it takes for your quarterback to accelerate up to that quote-unquote max speed, because with the analog stick, it's really not max speed until you pass the line of scrimmage, and you can tell with the touching, the touch controls, it is a lot, a lot faster. And on top of that, you don't have to run at a specific angle. You're basically limited to not clicking where your receivers are. And I left Russell Wilson fumbling because he's not immune to fumbling. And just wanted to show you guys that. And I think it's coming up soon. Yeah, see that? So right there, I had to touch the field twice in the direction I wanted to go before he actually started running. Before I touched it twice, he was locked in that uh, animation, similar to what you get with the with the analog stick. And then right here, look at this god play by the DB. I'm playing it in slow motion. Just look at him. Look, right now, look at that! He teleports! It's insane! But, what was I saying something about the analog stick? Uh... Oh, okay. So, at some angles, and... Okay, let's just go back to this. The touch controls allow you to go to your less dominant side. So typically, if you're using the analog stick, you'd be scooting awkwardly. But when you're using your touch controls, you're going to flip around and you can run that way. So I would never have been able to do that with touch controls. Russell Wilson being a wizard getting the football through the uprights. And as you can see, even with the QB sneak, there's no delay. So he doesn't have to accelerate up to that speed. Um, you can see he just guns it right from the get-go when I touch the screen. It takes a little bit of getting used to. Again, just so quick. So much faster than the analog stick. And I'm not going to switch from analog stick to touch control. It's just not worth it. You can't make adjustments on defense. But it's just good to know that this has been flying under the radar. And it actually allows you to go f fast, quickly. And you don't have to run at a specific angle. There's no workarounds. Uh, only problem is... Oh, this I just left in. Look at this cat. Look at that. I l oh my, stop belly flopping. But just the weird straddling catches. I love putting those in my videos. But as you can see, you can actually scramble in Madden Mobile. It's just not that viable, I guess. And a another example of me having to touch the field twice before he actually starts going... And this would take a lot longer to get used to. I obviously haven't played with it too much. And if you got good at it, this scrambling could kill people in head-to-head. -head. But it's just not good for defense and season mode. And frankly, I've been playing with the analog stick for too long to switch. So it's not viable for me. Maybe for some of you guys. But like I said, it's just good to know that you can actually scramble in Madden Mobile. Again, I had to double-click before he started running. And I'd urge you guys to try it out. It's pretty neat. Never knew this was possible. And I made a video called How to Scramble Before. And that's basically just running at an angle. And you'll get decent speed. Still not full speed. With the touch controls, you'll be able to go a little bit faster. You don't have to go at a specific angle. And it's just nice. I think this next clip here, I show you the difference in speed with the analog stick. So you're going to see the difference in speed right here. So take note, pay attention, see how fast Russell Wilson runs when I use the analog stick. So you can see it's a lot slower than what you've been seeing with the touch controls. And I'll show you a QB sneak here too. And you'll see that little pause for him to accelerate up. Yeah, right there. And then you will see the difference here. So touch controls back. And it's just a lot faster. And that's going to be about it, guys. Leave any suggestions down in the comments below. Give it a thumb up the butt if you enjoy. Take it easy. 12